Hi everybody, I'm calling this part nine and a half. This is, um, I'm getting down to the end, but I wanted to show you this. Um, let me move this light. I don't know if it'll show up, I hope it shows up. But there's a lot of, like, corrosion in, the, in here. I'm not sure whether it's corrosion or, um, or if it's, um, just the enamel of the wire it broke down but it, it's leaving a, a powdery somewhat sticky residue and I'm at 3429 that's pretty pretty far up there I didn't know it was going to be that many turns so I'm just keeping at it and the wire broke at 2561, but I think it just hit a snag and it broke. So I retaped it and I'm doing it some more. But I wanted to show you about like that corrosion. It's a lot of, I keep saying corrosion, but it's maybe not. It could be the enamel that broke down. So I don't know, you know, hopefully like, like the other coils aren't going to be broken or anything. That will really have my work cut out for me if I have to rewind a couple coils in the radio and then the other coils are more critical you know it depends which side of the coil is if it's like the tuned side of the radio that's going to make it you know pretty critical to get the right number of turns but at least I got a way of counting the turns when it comes off so I have to you know if I have to do that I'm just going to do what I have to do that's how I get the radio working and I know this is pretty crude with Mr. Crank Handle here, but it's doing the trick. Got 3,478, 80, 81, 82, 83. It's going faster now because the, the uh, diameter is getting smaller, so every time I crank it, it's going around faster than what it was, see? Just one, two cranks, two cr I mean, one crank here, one crank on the big crank is, let's see, like two and a half or almost three cranks. So we're going at it. And I didn't think it was going to be this many turns on it. 35... Over 3,500 turns already. 3,579. No, 3,520. 3,523. So it really surprised me how many turns around this thing. But can you imagine counting this thing like by hand, trying to take it off? It would be a, a nightmare. It would take, who knows, like a month to do it. I mean, to count it accurately would be a disaster. So here we go, it's counting like a charm, and that's what I wanted it to do. So here it's going. So that's it folks, I just wanted to point out that that powdery residue that's coming off the wire. And it is what it is, but you know it's from 1933, so it's decomposing I guess, or or it's corroding or something. So anyway, take it easy, folks. Uh, take it easy. Bye.